Today, we talk about... I'm just honestly like, this is blowing my mind. <laughs> you waste all this money on shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I have not been... Uh, you're not the first person to tell me that, for sure. It's insane. But Miles, welcome back. This is part oh, two. Hey. You've done uh, You've done the top six. You did a great job. Yeah, you nice. did a fantastic job. Oh, yeah. Now you get to pick the I'm ugliest... <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Ask Will Ferrell. I don't know. Uh, top, or I should say, ugly six. Pick out the ugliest six things in here that you would never go anywhere near. Okay, let me, let me take a look. <laughs> He's already oh, got one please. lined up. Which ones? All right. Um, I don't know if these are eggplants or what the fuck this is. <laughs> <laughs> You know what's hilarious? These just came out. The Air Max 720, the whole soul is pretty much like one big air bubble. But, uh, yeah, uh, you're the first person I've heard say that because I find these super gorgeous. It looks like a dog moves the ears cut off. I don't like this. If you saw this in the middle of the night, you think it's a monster. Ah, right in your face. This freaks me. I don't like this. Yeah. What's funny is I, I disagree that I think that they're ugly, but what I will give you is they are very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. Very uncomfortable. My senses. All right. And I have another one I saw. <laughs> where where are they? Hold on. They're like in this area. Um, your con the con well no it's Congress. Uh, you look thieves. Oh, these are Steph Curry's. I hate. I don't like the way they just. Yeah, I'm not going to lie to you. Not my favorite looking shoe, but uh, just because of Steph Curry's greatness, I had to get that and uh, part one. I believe this is part one and this part two. Yeah. But uh, yeah, man, not my favorite shoe. Haven't worn them yet. Basic, uh, I don't yeah. know. Not in a rush to wear them, but. I don't like those. I will I will uh, be on the same page with you on those Certainly. for sure. Uh, I have to go with these because the fact that you wear them when you go to the park makes me so angry. <laughs> <laughs> I have to do that. You know what's hilarious? <laughs> do you know Matt Summerstein? Yeah. So Matt Summerstein, Kev, and now you have all chosen the this thing. sneaker <laughs> in the series. This is hilarious. You guys have all chosen this as an ugly, top ugly six shoe. It that was the backstory that so got me. I was like, you just, ugh, I just, just <laughs> wear one shoe. <laughs> um, hey, I used to be a one shoe guy. One shoe guy? I, I would say this. If I had money, I would buy <laughs> I wouldn't go. I'd probably have a whole collection of Vans. I love Vans. Dude, yeah, Vans, Vans are, are good. Favorite. And there's a lot of good Vans, so. I want to get their new Comfy Co shoes. Oh, yeah, I've seen those. All plastered all over the subway. What is this? That is another Yeezy, actually. Like a cheesecake. <laughs> 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 a giant piece of cheddar. This is a number three. That is hilarious. I don't like the way they They're are. actually called, well, they used to be called the nickname of uh, Desert Rats, oh. which actually, to me, makes a lot of sense. It looks like a rat's like paw, a rat. you know I what I mean? That. But uh, I actually think these, man, they're super comfy, actually. So, But hey, I'll give it to you. I think, what is that, choice three? three. Was it three? You yeah, picked three. Uh, uh, Steph Curry. Oh, wait, no. One, the other side. Three that's and that's four. Okay, okay, so you got two more. Two more? Not even me, I don't know. <laughs> nah, dude, everyone says that, but I don't give a fuck. Business. Those are Visvim FBTs. I don't know what the, the Pocahontas make. <laughs> I think this part should be get rid of and just have that. Yeah, this is my number five. Five. All right. Choice. You know what's hilarious? I actually get compliments from these from uh, from girls when I wear them in the hospital. Really? Funny enough. I mean, it was only once. But you know, do you think you're Native American? <laughs> I respect <laughs> no, I you and so. your culture. No, no. But the whole story was yeah, it was inspired by uh, like a moccasin type shoe, mm -hmm. but with a sneaker sole for city wear. So and actually, uh, Kanye had a huge phase of wearing these back in like 2005 era. And so yeah. did John Mayer, and I'm a huge fan of both. So, but yeah, they are definitely out of style now. So no one's really yeah, rocking with these now. But. <laughs> yeah. so one more pick. Yeah, one more pick. One more. Whoops. Uh, what are those? Uh, what are those, Chucks? Nice pair of Chucks. I've knocked those down way too many times now. Like see through. Yeah, dude. Yeah, so change up the socks. Get a new look. Ah. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Oh, these are pretty looking good. <laughs> looking real good. Uh, let's see here. Uh, oh. God damn it. I got one. There, there's no reason why I don't like it. Like, visually, I like the, these are phone positive, right? Yep, yep. I only don't like these because in, in uh, middle school, kids would bully me because I, I couldn't afford these. <laughs> they had the gold phone positive and they would beat me up. Like, yo, you can't afford these. So I just wear Vans every day. <laughs> This makes this brings like bad memories. I don't know. I, I will tell you, I um, I got made fun of for not having uh, anything like your Adidas as well. But uh, but I've always thought these were half ugly, and actually holding them now, I actually find them slightly less ugly. But I agree with you, man. This is not. 
the pretty shoe by far in my collection. But just yeah. as far as like collecting historical sneakers, this was a must. That's a, have, yeah, I mean, so, yeah, yeah, the phone pauses were very. Yeah, dude. and that was the original colorway. So that's I'm good at, uh, with that. I'm not going to be getting any any more of these. Uh, just like black pants. <laughs> <laughs> and a blue Do you shirt. Wear this to the doctor? Like, oh yeah, I've worn those to work before. Like, like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've worn those to work before, believe it or not. I try to wear that's the best part about my job is like I can literally wear just like whatever sneaker and I have plain blue scrubs that would match pretty much any of these. So yeah, it's uh like if I was works dying out. and I saw you roll up in phone pods, I'm like, yo, is this a cool time? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot hear a lot. Like, yes. It's been funny because because a lot of kids will, will comment in the in my video comments like, yo, if my doctor showed up in those, I would fucking yo be my I'm doctor. Like, I'm like, dude, I'm like, dude, I don't want you to get sick just to, like see me. That'd be that'd be kinda whack. But That's uh so cool. <laughs> But yeah, man, thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Actually, a lot of people uh, typically that? pick these out. Uh, they actually re-released these not too long ago. Uh, Reebok Insta Pump Fury. So like the idea was the pump would pump up the shoes. So that, that's actually the idea behind these. Does it work? Uh, yeah. Uh, I mean, barely. It's a retro release. So it's, where's the pump? So you can kind of hear it, and then when you release it, I guess it's not really working here. Is it? Does it pump the bottom part? Like I think just like the this oh, the general pump. part, and then. Maybe it's not working. I don't know. So Whatever. Like drowning in <laughs> Pop them up, honey. Just that <laughs> yeah, actually, most people in the early part of these this series, a lot of people would gravitate to these um, as an ugly shoe, and I can't really blame them. But uh, you know, again, historic shoe. But yeah, Shaq shoes had the pump. These are actually the entire pump series by Reebok. So Reebok came out with these. Actually, some people consider this a super ugly shoe as well, but uh, badass to me. But yeah, you pump up the basketball, and then Nike responded with these as the first iteration, but they didn't even include like a built-in pump. You had to like, it came with a pump that you actually had to like manually, pump? which is so the stupid. The pumps? <laughs> no, just like a little squirter pump. And then this was like this, I think this was the second iteration. I don't know if you remember that movie, um, a White Man Can't Jump. Oh, uh, Woody Harrelson, yeah. Yeah, so Billy Hoyle, these are called the Billy Hoyles because Woody Harrelson's character wore these. And these are fucking dope. Jim Carrey wore these in, um, uh, I think on SNL, or In Living Color those when he was doing a vanilla ice skit. Yeah, dude, these are sick. Can't wait to bust these out this summer, hopefully. I still haven't worn these yet, actually. But yeah, these actually have the pump, too, so the, the back is where the, uh, the air would release, and then you would pump it by... Um, Oh, I think it's on the side. You, you pump it up by hitting this thing. You just like, like dress up the Fresh Prince of Bel Air with these. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Some retro shorts. With the <laughs> exactly, the nineties as flu. But yeah, man. Thanks for thanks for coming by. Yeah, appreciate, appreciate you joining you the series. I had a lot of fun. I learned a lot about Dope. shoes. Yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah, uh, stay tuned. We'll be having them on the podcast, oh, yeah. and uh, see you around. Yeah, please. <laughs>